Okay, are you guys ready to take it up a notch? Today we're going to do a digital read from a digital sensor. The one we're going to use is a knock sensor. It just detects a, it being knocked. And then we're going to do a digital write. And we're going to turn on the LED using the knock sensor. So, if you haven't done the first tutorials, where we talk about how to plug in and light up the LED, you should probably check them out. And uh, if you look down below here, you'll see a link to them. But let's go ahead and set up here. I'm going to use a green LED this time. A 220 ohm resistor to limit the current of the LED. And that plugs into the ground rail. Okay. Our signal wire from the LED, the positive, <clears throat> is going into a digital 12 of our Arduino, and that takes care of the LED. Next, we're going to plug in the knock sensor. If you can see that, if that's going to focus. We see we have negative on the left, so a positive in the middle signal on the right okay so let's plug that in here and we go negative to our negative rail positive to the positive rail And our signal wire is going to go to digital pin 2. And that completes our hookup. Now let's take a look at the programming. So here's the programming in the Arduino IDE, pin mode 2 is an input pull-up. What that's doing is just using the internal resistor in the AT328 so we don't have to use a resistor. Next line we set uh, digital pin 12 as an output then we come down to our loop. We're going to declare uh, set that variable sensor value as what is read from digital pin 2. Then we say if sensor value is high turn the light off. If sensor value is low, which is what will happen when that va when that sensor is knocked, uh, digital write 12 high and delay for a second. So what that will do is turn on the light when the sensor is knocked and delay for one second. There's the whole code in case you guys want it. Let's compile this and send it to the Arduino. Okay, the code has been compiled, and here we go. Pretty simple. Now think ahead. You can replace the LED with a relay to turn our lights on or off. You can replace the knock sensor with an infrared sensor. Lots of things you can do here. But I just want to show you how really simple it is. Any questions, ask them down below. If you like this, I'd appreciate a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Thanks for watching.